Mr. Ashard, what is the message that you've come to the European Parliament today to give? The, the main message is that we are uh, nowadays facing with a serious terrorist uh, groups and organizations that they have hidden their true nature and nowadays uh, we witness that they are showing their real face and we must seriously consider this and we must confront this <coughs> threat to the democracy, freedom and base the human values and that's our main <coughs> message that we've come uh, to the heart of uh, democracy in European Parliament to transfer to the uh, respectful uh, representatives of the European Parliament. And which particular organizations uh, are you referring to here? Um, we, I have been a member of the People's Mujahideen Organization of Iran since 1979. Even before that, I have been <coughs> the, the uh, head of uh, student organization in England and then I was responsible for the um, Pakistan country of the organization and then I was responsible for the Turkish uh, uh, branch of the organization. I have been a uh, member of the National Council of Resistance. I have been, uh, <coughs> uh, been responsible for uh, many branches inside. Um, I have been mainly active uh, teaching them, teaching, educating, um, using my knowledge as an <coughs> edu educated person in the United Kingdom uh, in order to, <coughs> uh, and th which the organization has actually utilized people like us uh, to hide their real uh, nature, their real uh, terrorist terroristic uh, natures which we are now witnessing that they are they have for instance in the past they uh, uh, praised the uh, September 11 ter uh, terrorist act openly and <coughs> nowadays they are uh, openly supporting uh, uh, ISIS as uh, and uh, calling them as freedom fighters and uh, recently uh, Mariam Rajavi has met uh, uh, one of uh, their uh, commanders in uh, uh, her base in Paris. So uh, this is what we think is the m what the European Parliament and the uh, European po uh, politicians must open their eyes and uh, do whatever they can uh, to oppose and stop uh, terrorists uh, in the shape of uh, those people who are <coughs> pretending to be seeking democracy. So when we see Miriam Ranjavi and the National Council for Resistance of Iran visit the European Parliament, um, you're saying they're not a government in waiting, they're in fact a terrorist organization? They are, they are indeed. Um, this has been, let me uh, frankly tell you, this has been our uh, strategic policy that we must hide our true terrorist nature and we must pretend to be liberals. And so when having, got, having uh, uh, reached the power and then we will fight and we will come bring down this uh, <coughs> democracy in the West. And uh, this has been the main <coughs> conflict inside the organization uh, between people like us that <coughs> uh, have joined the organization for, uh, as a student in the Europe for democracy that we believe is the best and uh, what the human <coughs> contemporary uh, human being has achieved. But they are <coughs> actually deceiving people and uh, pretending to, um, to uh, desire such a democracy, but they want to bring what ISIS is now uh, uh, putting into practice. And that's why we worry everybody 
And uh, we think that everybody should take action. And Maryam Rajavi must be uh, questioned, questioned about the true nature and why their true nature and why they have hidden all the books that they have talked about uh, against democracy. Why? Why every piece of paper has been <coughs> taken from uh, the reach of the media and why they are hiding and, <coughs> and why they are uh, uh, stopping every member from contacting the outside world. What, uh, what, what are they uh, frightened of? If they, if they believe in democracy, so they must uh, allow their members to speak, speak out, to, to be connected to the world. Because uh, if, 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 if there's anything, they must, what are they hiding? So that put the iron curtain around their members. So when the, this, there's iron wall, so there, there's something that they are afraid of being exposed to the world. Thank you, sir.